Hello everyone, this is Subhash. Welcome to Social Studies. In this video, we are going to discuss about 16th topic. The topic name is Election Process in India. So, let's get into the topic. India is a vast country, means having wide territory. And the Bharadesham Vishalamaina Bhubagam Kaligi Vundi. So, that's why India is called vast country. India is the highest populous country in the world. So, according to recent data, as of 2023 November, the population of India is 142.86 crores. Recent data prakaram Bharadish Janaba Nuta Nalabairindu point Yanabayar Kotlan. India became the largest country in the population. China has dropped to second place. Prapancha Janabalo, Bharadesham, Modatistanolo Nilabade, China. China has dropped to second place. So here, is it possible to gather all the people and take decisions? In the Janaba on a Bharat Deshunlo, Andhru Oke Sari, Oke the Gramite, Oka Nirnan Tisko Vadamanedi, Sadhya Mautunda. And no, it is not possible. So that is why election commission was established. EC, short form of the election commission. Please remember this. EC means here short form of the Election Commission. Election Commission of India. It is also known as Nirvachan Sadhan. Its headquarter is in New Delhi. It was formed on 25th January 1950. It's a constitutional body. Anaga Election Commission Anadi Rajanga Badda Samstanda Rajangandwara Air Padina Oka Samsta. It means autonomous body. Or independent body and is Vyam Pratpati Kaligina Samsta. It is not controlled by anyone. It takes its own decision. And it is not controlled by anyone. Ever cheta niantrin chapada manedi jargadu. Okay. It was completed 60 years on January 25th, 2010. So Election Commission of India celebrated Diamond Jubilee and announced as first voters' day on 25th January 2011. Since then, every year India celebrates National Voters Day on 25th January. So, Mudarsari Voter Dinochavani, Jatiya Voter Dinochavani, 2011, January 25th, Jarpkunam Gavati, January 25th, National Voters Day, Prakatin Chadanjarindi. So, every year, Jatiya Voter Dinochavani, January Iruayadina, Jarpkundunam. Okay. And next, what does Election Commission do? And what are the functions of Election Commission? And who appoints the commissioners of the EC? EC means already told you election commission. So let us see one by one. What does election commission do? Election commission conducts the elections to Lok Sabha and Rajya Sabha of the parliament and legislative bodies, state legislative bodies means assembly elections and the president and vice president and parliament ennikala to paatu rashtra assembly ennikala nirvahistundi alage rashtrapati mari upa rashtrapati ennikala ni kuda election commission nirvahistundi okay so already you know in our telangana assembly elections are going to be held in telangana very soon i mean in december 2023 already election commission issued election notification and uh, candidates started their election campaign already okay you know well until 2023 january General elections were held 17 times for Lok Sabha. And the Ippat Variki, Rinduvela Remud January Variki, Election Commission Stapin Chukuna Tarvata Nundi, 17 and Padi Hed Sarlu, Parliament Elections and Edin Prevention Jarindi. 17th General Elections were in 2019, 18th General Elections were going to be held in 2024. Padi Hed Sarlu, Pateke, Elections Jerge, Padendova Election, General Election and Edin, next 2024, April or Melo Jerabotune. Okay. So, the first general elections were held in 1952. Then, how many voters were in the first general elections? So, there were 17.32 crores. And the Padhiyadu, point mukpairundu kotla mandi, modati sari general election lo, vote vesina vari sankhya. Okay. But now, there are 94.5 crore voters. Present gauna, voter la sankhya. But according to your textbook, there are 62 crore voters. In the textbook, there are 62 crore voters in the textbook. But presently, according to the election commission, there are 94.5 crore voters right now. Okay? So, please remember this. 
functions of the election commission election commission already told you formed on 25th january 1950 it consists of a chief election commissioner and two other commissioners oka pradhana ennikala commissioner untadu mariyu iddaru itara commissioners untaru chief election commissioner is the head of the election commission okay mostly senior ias officers appointed as a chief election commissioner or other commissioners ante ఈ ఎన్నికల అధికారుల్ని చీఫ్ ఎలక్షన్ కమిషనర్ కావచ్చు ఇతర అధికారులు ఇతర ఎన్నికల అధికారులు కావచ్చు ఎక్కువగా ఐఏఎస్ ఆఫీసర్ని ఎవరిని సీనియర్ ఐఏఎస్ని మాత్రమే నియమిస్తారు ఓకే అట్ ప్రజెంట్ ఇట్ ఈస్ ఎ త్రీ మెంబర్స్ బాడీ ప్రస్తుతం త్రిసభ్య సంఘం ఎన్నికల సంఘం అనేది బట్ అర్లియర్ బిఫోర్ నైన్టీన్ నైంటీ త్రీ అక్టోబర్ ఇట్ వాజ్ ఎ సింగిల్ మెంబర్ బాడీ అంటే నైన్టీన్ నైంటీ త్రీ అక్టోబర్కి ముందు సింగిల్ మెంబర్ బాడీ ఎలక్షన్ కమిషన్ వాజ్ ఎ సింగిల్ మెంబర్ బాడీ అంటే ఏక సభ్య సంఘం ఒకే కమిషనర్ ఉండేవాడు But after 1993 October, it became a tripartite body. And it was a three-sabhya sanganga maari nanta, three members body ga maari nanta. Oka chief election commissioner untaadu, iddara, iddaru, iddara commissioners untaadu, okay? And then, who appoints the commissioners of the election commission? Ever name is Tharmari. E commissioners nanta, President of India appoints the chief election commissioner and other commissioners. Ever, ever, President of India, Veerani, name in chudu, jarutundi, okay? So, who was the first chief election commissioner? Here, the first chief election commissioner was Sukumar Sain. And at present, in 2023, Rajiv Kumar is the chief election commissioner. From the beginning, many persons served as a chief election commissioners. Chala mandi, chief election ga panche sir. But during TN session, TN session kaalang lo, he brought many changes in the election system. Changes means here, reforms and samskaranalu. Ennikala vidhanamla, chala marpal tiskaravadan jariyindhi evaru TN session. So, let us see TN session recommendations. Okay. TN session. His full name was Thirunelai Narayan Iyer session. Was an Indian civil servant. He served as the chief election commissioner between 1990-1996. 1990-1996 lo chief election commissioner ga TN session panchodan jariyindhi. So, here are session recommendations. సేషన్ ఇంట్రడ్యూస్డ్ ద ఓటర్ ఐడి కార్డ్స్ ఇప్పుడు మనకు వచ్చే ఓటర్ ఐడి కార్డ్ ఎవరు ఎవరి రికమెండేషన్ వల్ల వచ్చింది టిఎన్ సేషన్ రికమెండేషన్ వల్ల ఓకే ఎలక్షన్ క్యాంపెయిన్ వాజ్ రెడ్యూస్ టు ఫోర్టీన్ డేస్ బట్ బిఫోర్ టిఎన్ సేషన్ క్యాంపెయిన్ ఎలక్షన్ క్యాంపెయిన్ వాజ్ ట్వంటీ వన్ డేస్ టిఎన్ సేషన్ కంటే ముందు ఎలక్షన్స్ ప్రచారం ఎన్ని రోజులు ఉండేది దెర్ వాజ్ ట్వంటీ వన్ డేస్ బట్ నావ్ ఇట్ వాజ్ రెడ్యూస్ టు ఫోర్టీన్ డేస్ పద్నాలుగు రోజులకే ఎన్నికల ప్రచారాన్ని కుదించడం జరిగింది ఓకే One candidate should not contest from more than two constituencies at a time. And the one who has two constituencies at a time, will be able to do two constituencies at a time. For example, PM Modi will be able to do two constituencies at the same time. Vadodara. Gujarat will be able to do two constituencies at a time. But not more than two. And the two constituencies at a time. Okay. After completion of election campaign, After completion of election campaign, sale of liquor shall be banned for 48 hours liquor means here alcohol all kind of liquor shops should be closed 48 hours before the election time ante enni kala thedi ki 48 gantala munde anni kuda close cheyali ante liquor shops two days two days before the election date enni kala thedi ki mundu anni liquor shops should be closed kachithanga ban cheyali okay if the candidate punished for two years if or she he sorry he or she is barred from contesting elections for the next 6 years it means candidates should not participate in the elections if he or she is sentenced by the court ante edaina cheating leda criminal case lo rendu samasralu leda antaku minchi shikshinchabadte court dwara they are not eligible to participate in the elections ante ennikallo poti cheyadaniki veelu ledhu okay and if the candidates expire the election shall be postponed but not be abolished it means in case candidates dies the election should be postponed for a few days or a few months but not be cancelled ante etti paristhitlo cancel cheyakudadu raddu cheyakudadu only postpone cheyali a few days kavachu itme few days or few weeks or few months but not be cancelled etti paristhitlo raddu cheyakudadu evaraina abbardi maraninchithe okay so all of these recommendations given by tn session okay please remember this and what are the functions of the election commission so article 324 
refers to powers and functions of the election commission it means 324 says election commission duties and powers ante adhikaralu mariyu vidula gurinchi 324 article anedi telayestundi evaridi ennikala sangham yokka adhikaralu okay so let us see what kind of powers and functions administrative functions advisory functions and quasi judiciary functions quasi means here semi judicial anaga ardha nyaya vyavastha it is not equal to judiciary ante nyaya sthananiki idi samanamainadi kaadu the election commission performs the following functions election commission prepare the voter list and issues the id cards to voters voter list ni prepare cheyadame kaakunda id cards ni kuda voter ki issue chestundi okay ec prepare the time table for the elections and demarcation of constituencies ante niyojaka vargala vibhajana chestundi ante it means election commission can change the boundaries of the constituencies ante niyojaka vargala sariyaddulnu marchutundi eppudu when if the population grows up constituency border has to be changed eppudaithe janaba perugutundo appudu niyojaka vargala sariyaddulnu marchalsi ostundi it depends on the growing population then what is constituency here the constituency is a group of voters in a specified area అంటే నియోజకవర్గం అనేది ఒక నిర్దిష్ట ప్రాంతంలోని ఓటర్ల సమూహం అంటే ఒక మెంబర్ ఆఫ్ పార్లమెంట్కి ఎంత ఏరియా అంటే ఎంతమంది ఓటర్లు ఉండాలి ఒక అసెంబ్లీ సభ్యుడికి అంటే లెజిస్లేటివ్ అసెంబ్లీ మెంబర్కి ఎంతమంది ఓటర్లు ఉండాలి అంటే అందులో ఎన్ని మండలాలు ఎన్ని ఏరియాలు ఉండాలి అనేది నిర్ణయించేది కాన్స్టిట్యున్సీ ఓకే ద ఎలక్షన్ కమిషన్ అలౌస్ ద ఎలిజిబుల్ క్యాండిడేట్స్ టు కంటెస్ట్ ద ఎలక్షన్స్ అండ్ రిసీవ్ ద నామినేషన్స్ ఫ్రమ్ ద క్యాండిడేట్స్ రికాగ్నైజ్ ద పొలిటికల్ పార్టీస్ అండ్ allot the symbols to the parties nominations swikaristundi candidates nunchi plus parties ni recognize chesi vaatiki symbol ni kuda allot cheyadam jarugutundi evaru ec okay and conduct of polls it frame the code of conduct and executes ante eppudaithe election notification release chestundo and when went in immediately code of conduct kuda comes into effect ante amal loki vastundi okay and scrutinizing of election ఎక్స్పెన్సెస్ ఆఫ్ క్యాండిడేట్స్ ఆఫ్టర్ ద ఎలక్షన్ ఎన్నికల అనంతరం ఏం చేస్తుంది ఇది ఎక్స్పెన్స్ ఎలక్షన్ ఎక్స్పెన్స్ కూడా అంటే ఎంత ఖర్చు చేశారు వీళ్ళు ఎలక్షన్లో అనేది కూడా స్క్రూటినైజ్ చేయడం జరుగుతుంది ఎలక్షన్ కమిషన్ ఆఫ్టర్ ద ఎలక్షన్ ప్రాసెస్ ఓకే అండ్ విల్ నెక్స్ట్ విల్ సీ కోజీ జ్యుడిషియల్ ఫంక్షన్స్ ఎలక్షన్ కమిషన్ రెస్పాన్సిబిలిటీ ఈజ్ టు రిజాల్వ్ ద డిస్ప్యూట్స్ బిట్వీన్ ద పార్టీస్ పార్టీల మధ్య ఉండే ఘర్షణని ఎవరు సాల్వ్ చేయాలి ఇక్కడ ఎలక్షన్ కమిషన్ సో వ్యాన్ డిస్ప్యూట్స్ అరైజ్ ఇన్ ద ఎలక్షన్స్ ఎన్నికల్లో ఎక్కడైతే ఎన్నికల్లో డిస్ప్యూట్స్ వివాదాలు తలెత్తుతాయో అక్కడ ఏం చేయాలి ఎలక్షన్ కమిషన్ అనేది వాటి మధ్య ఘర్షణని సాల్వ్ చేస్తుంది ఇట్ ఈస్ ద రెస్పాన్సిబిలిటీ ఆఫ్ ఎలక్షన్ కమిషన్ ఓకే ఇట్ అడ్వైజ్ ద ప్రెసిడెంట్ అండ్ ద గవర్నర్స్ ఆఫ్ ద స్టేట్స్ రిగార్డింగ్ డిస్క్వాలిఫికేషన్ ఆఫ్ ద రిప్రజెంటేటివ్స్ ఎవరైనా ఎమ్మెల్యేస్ కావచ్చు ఎంపీస్ కావచ్చు క్యాండిడేట్స్ రిప్రజెంటేటివ్స్ వారు డిస్క్వాలిఫై చేయాలన్నా వారికి సంబంధించి అర్హతలు ఏంటి అనేది తెలుసుకోవాలన్నా నిర్ణయించాలన్నా కూడా ఏం చేస్తుంది ప్రెసిడెంట్కి ప్రెసిడెంట్ ఆఫ్ ఇండియాకి అండ్ స్టేట్స్ గవర్నర్స్కి ముందుగా తెలియచేయడం జరుగుతుంది ఎలక్షన్ కమిషన్ అనేది ఓకే అండ్ నెక్స్ట్ యూనివర్సల్ అడల్ట్ ఫ్రాంచైజ్ అనగా వయోజన ఓటు హక్కు ద రైట్ టు ఓట్ వితౌట్ ఎనీ డిస్క్రిమినేషన్ ఇస్ కాల్డ్ యాజ్ యూనివర్సల్ అడల్ట్ ఫ్రాంచైజ్ It means there is no need of qualification like caste, religion, gender, education, poor, rich, etc. Okay? They don't ask anything about your personals. Just they consider your age. Okay, well, here we are. You are the only person who is in the world. You are the only person who is in the world. That means, Kulam, Matam, Prantam, Dhani, Kape, Dhani, Thedalu. You are the only person who is in the world. Universal Adult Franchise. That means, Vyojana Vodu Hakku. So, just they consider your age your age is the only qualification if you are at the age of 18 you will be able to get right to vote meeku 18 samvatsaralu vachu unte chalu inke emi avasaram ledhu at present right to vote age is 18 years but until 1988 it was 21 years during the rajiv gandhi period voting right age was reduced from 21 years to 18 years gathamlo ఓటు హక్కు వయసు అనేది ఇరవై ఒక్క సంవత్సరాలు ఉండేది కానీ రాజీవ్ గాంధీ కాలంలో నైన్టీన్ ఎయిటీ ఎయిట్లో ఇట్ వాజ్ రెడ్ జ్యూస్ టు ఎయిటీన్ ఇయర్స్ అంటే పద్దెనిమిది సంవత్సరాలకి తగ్గించారు ఓకే అండ్ పొలిటికల్ పార్టీస్ ఇన్ ఎలక్షన్స్ ఎలక్షన్ కమిషన్ డిక్లేర్స్ సమ్ క్రైటీరియా టు రికాగ్నైజ్ ద పొలిటికల్ పార్టీస్ టు నో 
which is the national party or which is the regional party so it's a mandatory and election commission put a criteria and it is a mandatory and a compulsory and them okay there is a measure to identify the parties okay so let's see here for example in your state if a party wins three percentage valid votes or three assembly seats it is declared as a regional party and a okay any color three percentage vote to start in china valid vote to start in china lay the three assembly seats start in china put a done in a regional party in the constituent party a party got put in charge of the or if a national party for example national party if a party is recognized in four states with six percentage valid votes or 11 looks about seats from four different states it's called as sorry it's called a national party and they could a prantia party ki kevalan three percentage valid votes matra me ravali ledan te three seats sadhin chali adhi only okay state lo okay single state lo but the national party and the four states lo six percentage valid votes ravali ledu eleven looks about and the padukundu seat lo mp seat lo sadhin chali apude manon dhani national party it is called a national party jatiya party ga gurthin chadam zaruthundi okay the code of conduct election commission releases code of conduct when the commission announced the election schedule since then the model code of conduct comes into effect immediate ga eppudaithe election commission election schedule eppudaithe release chestundo immediate ga since then the model code of conduct kuda comes into effect ante amal loku vastundi code of conduct anedi it means in the election process code of conduct tells us what to do and what not to do em cheyali enikalo em cheyakoddu anedi code of conduct manaki telaistundi it means election commission try to conduct fair elections ante ennikala sangam ennikal ni nishpakshapatanga nirvahinchinduku prayatnistundi ani ardham ante election commission it doesn't support to anyone evariki ad support cheyadu nishpakshapatanga ennikal ni nirvahistundi okay if anybody violate or break the rules action shall be taken by the ec election commission anedi action teesukuntundi evaraina rules break chesthe code of conduct election rules ni ganaka break chesthe election commission shall be taken action okay here in this table code of conduct election rules and regulations has been given in this table so please just read this twice or thrice kachithanga ikku two or three times meer deenni ganaka chadivithe chala baga gurtuntundi if the political party wants to do road show rallies or public meeting should inform the police and take the permission it means we should take the permission before going to road show or rallies ante any party edaina party aina sare mana road show ku vellana rallies theyalanna public meeting metalana first we should inform to the police police ku mana information ichi aa tarvata em cheyali we have to take the permission from them valanchi mana permission theesukovali enduku because police could make arrangements to protect the law and order and to prevent rights rights means allarlu ante allarlu jaragakunda ledante shanti bhadratalu anedi lopinchakunda kaapadadaniki vallu police vallu prayatnam chestaru so that's why we should take permission from the police before going to the rallies or road shows or public meetings okay on the day of polling date election commission issues identity to the polling agents to make arrangements to voters to cast their vote in democratic manner praja samaya paddhatilo annikal nirvahinchadaniki em chestundi police polling agents ki ID కార్డ్స్ సప్లై చేస్తుంది అలాగే ఓటర్స్ కూడా ఐడి కార్డ్స్ సప్లై చేస్తుంది అక్కడ ప్రశాంతమైన వాతావరణాన్ని క్రియేట్ చేస్తుంది ఓకే ఎలక్షన్ క్యాంపెయిన్ షుడ్ ఎండ్ బిఫోర్ ద ఫార్టీ ఎయిట్ అవర్స్ ఆఫ్ ద పోలింగ్ డేట్ అంటే ఎలక్షన్కి ముందు నలభై ఎనిమిది గంటల ముందే అంటే టూ డేస్ బిఫోరే ఎలక్షన్ క్యాంపెయిన్ అనేది షుడ్ బీ ఎండ్ అంటే క్లోజ్ చేసుకోవాలి అంటే పార్టీస్ షుడ్ నాట్ మెయింటైన్ షుడ్ నాట్ కంటిన్యూ ఎలక్షన్ క్యాంపెయిన్ ఆన్ ద పోలింగ్ డే ఆ పోలింగ్ రోజున కూడా ఎలాంటి ఎలక్షన్ క్యాంపెయిన్ కానీ ఎలాంటివి నిర్వహించకూడదు షుడ్ అండ్ బిఫోర్ ద ఫార్టీ ఎయిట్ అవర్స్ ఆఫ్ ద పోలింగ్ డేట్ ఓకే ఇట్ ఈస్ మ్యాండేటరీ పార్టీస్ షుడ్ ఫాలో ద ఈసీ రూల్స్ ఓకే ఇఫ్ నాట్ ద క్యాండిడేట్స్ విల్ బీ డిస్క్వాలిఫైడ్ అలా కనుక చేయకపోతే క్యాండిడేట్స్ ఏం చేస్తుంది ఎలక్షన్ కమిషన్ విల్ బీ డిస్క్వాలిఫైడ్ ఓకే కంటెస్టింగ్ క్యాండిడేట్స్ అండ్ ద సపోర్టర్స్ డు నాట్ గ్యాదర్ నియర్ ద పోలింగ్ స్టేషన్స్ పార్టీ సింబల్స్ ఆఫ్ ఫ్లాగ్స్ posters shall not be allowed to the polling stations and polling camps camp polling camp lo gavachu polling stations and polling station means here polling booth lo gavachu and flags posters gaani party ki sambandhina vyaktulu gaani enter kavadaniki veelledu do not enter into the polling stations okay mostly 
ruling party candidates and supporters try to influence the voters. Pratisari, Jarike Dekoga, ruling party, every the Adikara party, they try to influence the voters by misusing the powers and bureaucracy. And every the Adikara Ganam, bureaucracy and higher officials, Adikara Ganam, Varito Ganil and Valek Adikara Nupia in Chicana, Valenjasar, they try to influence the voters to get highest votes. Okay. The Election Commission of India divides the India into some constituencies. In every constituency, returning officer appointed to monitor elections. And presenting officer is appointed to the polling stations. Already I told you what is constituency. Constituency is a group of voters in a specified area. Okay. Here, who is the returning officer? Returning officer is the head of constituency. And who is the presenting officer? Presenting officer is the head of polling station or polling booth. Okay. Contestants, sorry, contestant candidates submit their nominations to the returning officer. Candidates can withdraw their nominations if they are not interested. Okay. Returning officer check their nominations and announce the eligible candidates. Chief election officer shall make arrangements to conduct the polls. So here, mostly school staff are used for election management. Manak ekwaga election at the ground level and nikal sibbandi ever kan pistaru mainly school staff kan pistaru. Mostly school staff are used for election management. Election commission have been using EVMs. EVM mean here electronic voting machines for many years. In case EVM is not there, instead we can use swastik mark or swastik symbol on the ballot paper. The old system lo lagane, okay, well, EVM gan kalle kipate, old system lagwa swastik mark in manam apply cheye chakada polling station. Okay, when the voters entered into the polling station, polling staff check their ID and put the ink mark on the left forefinger. So we can call left forefinger or index finger on a chula than the forefinger and put a chante adama chupudu velu adama chedioka chupudu velu okay after the completion of polling evms or ballot boxes are sealed and brought to counting centers after counting who secure is number of votes is declared as elected and ever get the echo vote loss thayo counting throughout the varne gilich nutiga prakatinchan jarutun so this is called First passed the post system. It means simple majority and sadaran majority padati antam. Four members can contest candidates vote each is the and the Yavariki equeste vare gilchnutra declare chestar. Who secure highest number of votes? Yavariki equeste valane declare chestar. So this is called the name and first passed the post system. It means a simple majority. Okay. So here we look at the meanings of some words. Already told you. EC is the short form of election commission. MP, member of parliament. And parliament subdu. MLA, member of legislative assembly. And Shasana Sabha subdu. Electorate, the body of voters. Constituency, already told you. Constituency is a geographical area or a constituency is a group of voters in a specified area. And this is voter la samuham. General elections. General elections are conducted for every four years. When the parliament complete its full term, full term means here fixed period of time. And okay, niyamita kala ani ki mano ennu koran jaru thundi. Our time complete ka gaane. Then again, general elections will be conducted. Okay, and midterm elections. And the madhya antar ennu kalu. If the government loses its majority before the completion of its term, and the dhanyo ka period time ka ka munde. And then, then, a fixed time, then, then, already, already, five years, then, 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 and by elections ante upa ennikalu by elections can happen due to various reasons ante chaala kaaranalu untai by elections jarapali ante such as when a member of parliament or a member of legislative resigns or dies ante rajinama chesina ledante maraninchina aa place lo aa constituency lo by elections anedi jarapabadtayi 
by elections can also take place if a person is disqualified or removed from their position in the situation by elections or held ante ilante sandarbham lo ante oka vela disqualify aina abhyardhi ledante tan yokka sabhyatvanni raddu chesina kuda aa constituency lo abhyardhi ekka nunchi aitha poti chesadu aa constituency lo malli by elections upa ennikalu anedi nirvahinchabadtayi okay so that's all for now we will meet in the next video until then bye bye